What's up guys, Matt here, and welcome to another Forza video. Um, today, as you guys can see, we got wheel cam um, playing Forza. It's going to be kind of screwing around. Um, not really doing too, too much here. I uh, just wanted to kind of set it up um, to a point where you guys can see um, what goes on here. So yeah, pretty much I'm just kind of screwing around, um, just doing some laps on the Nurburgring, um, which is very, very cool. Let's go home. It's a regular old Nurburgring. Um, yeah, so as you guys can see here, I got the Thrustmaster Ferrari 458 Ita uh, Spider Edition, not the Italia. Italia is the more expensive one. I just got this wheel because it's a cheap, cheaper wheel. Um, about a hundred dollars. It's not too fancy. It doesn't have a clutch. I actually can't drive stick. Um, I, I haven't taken the time to learn. So, um, yeah. So right now we are driving um, the. Let's see. What are we driving again? I don't remember. Uh, wow. Ariel Adam. There we go. So yeah. Don't judge me if I do horrible because I turned um, stimulation simulation driving on. There we go. But yeah. If you guys are interested, oh, 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 I gotta move the pedals up, I'm sorry, yeah, there we go, six foot four, <laughs> not that tall though, alright, you guys definitely gonna let me know if you guys like this type of video, um, I can do more, so we're probably gonna do one lap or so, maybe two laps on the Nurburgring, um, Turn this down a little bit on my headset. But yeah, as you guys can see, I've changed around my setup a lot. Um, I'll do a full tour very soon. Oh, oh, sorry, I'm just testing the brakes. There we go. Don't look down at the map. All right, oh, that was a bad, bad idea, bad idea. Okay, all right. There we go. Stay in third here. Yeah, with stimulation, if you oversteer at all, it really kicks out because it's a very light car. And does this, does this. But as you guys can see, we got the paddle shifters here. Which is nice. It's sequential shifting. So there's no clutch. Um, well, there, there, it, there is a clutch in these, but... It's a hard turn. I wasn't looking at the map. Alright, here we go. It's a little straight away. Make this nice and easy. There we go. Too, too, too much break. Too much break. Too much break. Okay. But yeah, um, I guess I can talk a little bit about how I pre-ordered Forza Horizons. Um, I traded in my PS Vita because I don't, I haven't used it in a while, and um, I don't know I have a bunch of games that I wanted to get, 
for the Xbox One. So I actually pre-ordered Assassin's Creed Unity, and I also pre-ordered, um, let's see, I also pre-ordered Forza Horizon 2, which looks awesome, um, I do have to say, with the money that I got from trading that in. Um, and I also got this Thrustmaster, so that's really cool. Um, Forza Horizon 2 looks really good. Um, I wanted to play Forza Horizon 1, but by the time I was going to go get it, Xbox One was right around the corner, and I never really got a chance to go buy it. So, um, yeah. Fish tailing. Well, yeah, I think I'm just going to do one lap here because it's a really long track. Um, the Nürburgring, I think, is like, what, um, 12 miles or so. Maybe it's an 8 mile track, I'm not sure. But, um, it's a pretty, really long track. Okay, yeah, get those drift points in. Alright, let's get out of the grass here. Alright, let's just uh, slow down. But yeah, one of the main problems with this is because um, I'm on carpeted floor and I don't have like an actual racing seat set up, um, the, the pedals slip around. So if you're on a carpeted thing, you might want to think about getting carpet like kind of grabbers or whatever. Um, which I mean, like, because they have grabbers underneath these pedals, but. Um, they don't grab on a carpet. They, it's like meant for metal or hardwood or something like that. So if you're in a hardwood or metal surface, um, you should be okay. But uh, yeah, if you're uncarpeted, be prepared for them to slide around. Uh, but yeah, so I think I'm just gonna go eventually pick up some little, I think um, you can get them in like furniture sections of stores, because um, you can put them under like couches and chairs and stuff. And uh, yeah, also if you guys are wondering, if you guys want to see what, what the pedal, pedal is doing, oh, sorry I looked at my recording. Um, if you look in the bottom right, if you guys don't play Forza, then you might not know this. The blue, like, if you, if you see here, if I press the brake, the bottom right, um, that's where it shows you the pressures for my pedals. But yeah, so I'm not good enough to do, not good enough to do, um, like, actual live things with other players yet. So that's why I'm just kind of doing these videos, just kind of playing around. Probably use a different car next, next episode, or uh, next video. If you guys like it. Okay, simulation steering, kicking in. But yeah, if you guys have a wheel, and you're kind of like a novice like I am, what I found, if you turn simulation steering on, it helps a lot better when you're doing those really sharp corners, because it actually like simulates when you're, when you're literally pinning your steering wheel all the way to one direction, um, it's going to most likely turn the car pretty quick, so... As you can see, we haven't even finished one lap yet. That's why I chose this one. But yeah, I think it might be 12 miles. Whoa, 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 whoa.
I'm gonna get out of this grass. It just keeps sucking me in. Yeah, I think for the rest of this lap, I'm just going to try to be kind of quiet. Try to focus a lot on the game instead of talking. <laughs> so, yeah. Probably put some music on right now. Maxing power! I hope you guys did enjoy um, being at my first wheel cam. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Matt. Please, as always, comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you in the next video. Peace.